Yo, what's poppin' Coutinho Corner fan and welcome back to another episode of the Coutinho Corner with me, Josh Dad. Hope you guys are well, hope you guys are swell, man. And if you guys are new to the channel, please don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you do not miss a beat and you don't miss when an episode drops of mine. And if you're a recurring subscriber, yeah, it's a virtual hug. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, family, welcome back. So today's episode, we got a dope review. No, not a review at all. I feel collaboration, styling, all of that jazz, man. So today's episode, I'll be showing you guys how to style the New Balance 550 made in 89, man. So these are the bad boys. Bam, bam. Thank you, man. Man, I love these shoes. I've been waiting for a 550. And before I start, I would say that this is probably the most slipped on colorway of the pack. I just love how the red gives it a pop of color. And when I was deciding to style this outfit, I wanted to go with a lot of like neutral colors so the shoe could pop. Because I, I it had to pop, man. It had to pop. It had to pop because it is the main pro is the main out piece of the outfit. So man, so this is the 550 New Balance 550 main 89. I did get these for 2199. I do know that they're selling on the resale mark for 3.5, but don't worry, they'll be all discussed on Sneaker Vaults, you guys. So if you guys haven't watched that episode, you must go watch that episode of Sneaker Vaults so you guys know what's happening with the shoe, man. But yeah, man, this was the 550. Love the shoe, love the shoe, love the shoe. Can't wait to actually start collecting more and getting more dubs on the sneaker, man. So let's break down the whole entire alpha so you guys know I have to start with the six ex I'm saying the six the accessories man so I always gotta start so I managed to actually find a beanie after rocking and you know last time I told you I rock a beanie and then the beanie disappears until the next time I have to I have to rock another outfit so yeah man this is the beanie that I rocked with the outfits now I did get this from Sporty and this is a red bad beanie I really did I made it into a fisherman style beanie because that's the for me personally, that's the best way to rock, and especially in summer, it's the best way to rock a beanie for me personally. So yeah, I mean, this thing was like 200 bucks or 150, I'm not mistaken. I did get this on holiday when my hair was a mess, so I needed a beanie at the time. But yeah, man, this was a lovely addition. I love the gray colorway because it's all like a neutral colorway, so it just goes with like a lot of outfits that I try. So yeah, man, when you, if you want that beanie style, I do roll it up about. So this is actually how the beanie looks itself. You guys can see. So this is how the beanie actually looks. So it's pretty long. So I I roll it up about let me actually show you guys so I make one line so this would be the length for one line and then I roll it up like three times so one and oh, let me not say three times let's say two times and then eventually the beanie sits like this and then you can rock it like that so that's how the fisherman beanie goes so if you guys wanted this and then the next accessory that i tried it with was my ever so trustworthy tote bag that i did pick up from cotton on so this is part of the cotton on foundation if i'm not mistaken so yeah man these are really cool i think they're actually trying to go away bags so if you actually want to go shop at cotton on you must take one of these bags you know and these like go for 30 bucks so it's like a lot of nice colorways that you can just like throw on and it just gives your outfit a pop of color so if your outfit's like all black this white would dope go dope the green will go dope the pink the blue it just gives a lovely pop of color and allows you to just hold things as well i think tote bags are an amazing amazing accessory to have when you're also just going through outfits man so yeah and with the top i just styled it with a normal vest tank top but i wasn't actually showing off the vest so that's why i didn't show it on the the styling thing i had to cover it up with the jacket so let's get into the jacket so this lovely nevada jacket that is from my dad's closet it's just amazing i love the fact that it has the scrunchiness of here so kind of like can pull off like a crop feeling on the, the way you you rock it so it can always just sit on your waist exactly it doesn't go over your waist and i just love that it's like eyes and what i love when you can actually just fold it up it has the buttons over here so it comes with this cool little polo neck type of vibe but it's not really a polo neck type of vibe it just looks really really dope with the beanie man and i just love the neutral colors this lovely brown is just amazing and it's not too hot either so it's like a nice when it just gets a bit chilly in summer you can just throw it on so i think that's really really dope and I just love it. Like, man, look at the back. Look at the details at the back, actually, man. How crazy is that? Like, this, these, like, wave type of cloud thingies are so dope. So, the details on this is crazy. And, you know, like, old school jackets, they really don't make them like they used to. The quality on the old school jackets just, like, last, 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 man. And the fact that I can actually just go to my dad's closet and just, like, throw it on and make it out for pop, it's really, really dope. And then another piece of my dad's closet is the pants, man. So, I've overtaken these pants because they don't fit my father anymore. But yeah, man, these are some Pringle straight, straight leg corduroy uh, pants, and I really do love them. They're like white. I think they're like off whitish because I think that like with age they've kind of like just lost their white white whiteness. But I just think it's lovely. I think the colors just match perfectly, and they're all neutral tones. So I mean, the brown and this this looks so good together with that gray beanie and the white tote. So I was really really stoked 
we're gonna rock this man so as you can see there's the pringle logo pringle essa if you're watching this man send the boy some pants i love your guys pants and how it fits on me guys send the boy some pants but yeah man this was amazing so pe pretty much this whole outfit that i styled was literally free man everything's literally for my dad's closet just besides the tote which is 30 bucks and this will be in 100 and 150 besides the shoes man but the clothes itself were all for free and i really do love that that's why i really love i think it's also very good for the vibe and that's why people like thrifting and just you know there's a lot of clothes a lot of clothes have a lot of life on, on into it so i just like the fact that i can just reuse it and reuse it and reuse it because that's what clothes are for man and yeah guys and this was how i styled the new balance 550 from 89 in with the red the red white black colorway let me know if you guys enjoyed the way i styled it if 10 out of 10 being it's amazing 2 out of 10 being it's pool man and guys let me know let me know in the comment section i need those comments to show to, to see if, I, if you guys are feeling my outfits man it's, it really goes a long way and and guys don't forget that same one that i'm running man send those outfits to my instagram don't forget you have to be following me on instagram subscribe to my channel and send it to joshua dunn dot double underscore on my instagram handle so i can rate your outfits i need 10 outfits to rate so i can do the i really want to shoot this video soon guys so please so please 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 send them see please please send them through man and uh, trust me it's going to be a really fun experience man but this is josh dunn continue corner i'll be signing out peace